let's speak a little about this, right? The most Americans are moving back. Yeah. You know? Diasporans are moving back and they are mm. so excited about the continent mm. and they believe Africa is the future. But the African youth are hopping from embassies to embassies, <laughs> selling their lands that they have to seek for visa to go and work in McDonald's. <laughs> Why do you think we have this mindset? Hello and welcome back again <laughs> to another amazing episode. This is a diaspora transition episode where we interview people who move back from, you know, the diaspora and currently living here in Ghana, or even people who have traveled back and forth and are interested in doing some businesses here. So we speak to them, you know, ask them their challenges, you know, how they get, you know, they got started. And yeah, on this episode, we have here with us a very young woman, you know, entrepreneur-like mindset, and she's doing great. She has her own tea. If you know some famous, you know, tea, they have tea bags and everything, but she has her own tea bag and she grow the plants here on the continent and you know, do everything by herself and I can't wait to speak to her. So without further ado, welcome I on the show. Afi Boatima, is that your name? Afi Boatima. Afi, I like to call her Afi, but that is, that is how to say uh, Afi, Afi in a gang. Ewe. In Ewe, okay. Yes. Welcome on the show. Thank you. Wow, and that, that is your farm? Yes, please. Wow, tell me about this. What is this plant? This is a lemongrass plant. Okay. Yes, it's grown here. Mm -hmm. So what we do is we grow and mm -hmm. we process it into tea bags okay. for consumption. Okay. So how did it start it for you? You know, at what point do you think, okay, I have to start growing my own plants and then turn it into tea bags? Can you walk me through that process? I believe in planting mm -hmm. and start growing what we eat here in Ghana. Okay. Okay. So I decided to just plant it. Okay. First, when I started the business, I was okay. outsourcing it from people. Oh, okay. So I decided to get a place to mm -hmm. plant it and process it myself, okay. making it more hygienic, hygienic. and yes. safe for consumption. Okay, so first you used to go to the farmers and then take it from them, yes. but now you decided to grow your own thing. Yes, please. Now, how long does it take to, to, to grow? Between three, between three to four months. Three to four months. Yes. Now, as a young woman, and you are saying, okay, I want to go and do farm and plant my own, you know. Mm -hmm. How did your family react to that? They are supportive, 100%. Are, really? Yes. Now, you know that is very unlikely to get your African parents to support you. 100% support, wow. supportive. Wow. wow. So yeah. tell us about what you do, uh, about the tea bags and the nutrients, how it came about. So this is the lemongrass. Mm -hmm. So after we take it from here, we take it back to Accra, we okay. pray, that's what the processing center is. Mm -hmm. And we do it into tea bags. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Wow. It's 100% lemongrass, no wow. additive. And this is the box? Yeah, this is how it comes wow. in. Yeah. La Bella Farms. La Belle Farms. Oh, La Belle. Yes, mm. please. And then, Maury, hey, I'm sorry. Lemongrass lemon tea. tea yes. 20 tea bags. Yes. Wow. I like the packaging. Thank you. And it's it's also FDA approved. Yeah, yes, it is. Wow. Wow. Mm. So, lemongrass tea. Yes. Why not um, other thing but lemon? Lemongrass is very mm -hmm. healthy. When growing up, we used to add uh, music for tea, mm -hmm. and it was very nutritious. So, mm -hmm. I decided, okay. Why don't I promote the growth of and the use of lemongrass here in Ghana? Mm -hmm. So I, that's how I started. Wow. How business. long have you been doing this now? The business is two and a half years. Two and a half years. Yes. Tell me, what has been some major challenges since you started doing this? Mm, getting access to the market. Mm -hmm. And you know, we Canadians, we, are, we find it very difficult mm -hmm. um, accepting a new product. Right. So that's one of my challenges, marketing. Mm -hmm. Marketing mm -hmm. and financing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Marketing and financing. Yeah. Wow. So, mm -hmm. I mean, being an African and mm -hmm. being on the continent and yeah. deciding not to leave the country or escape like most people do, mm -hmm. but to stay, grow your own fruit and, and you know, to make your own products and sell here in Ghana. Mm -hmm. Why? I want to help the, I want to help Ghana. Let's make it a center for, no, let's say I want to champion the use of lemongrass in Ghana. Wow. So that's why I said it. If people are watching right now yeah. and they, they love your passion, you know, you're doing this by yourself. Yeah. They want to be able to patronize your products. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How do they go about it? 
So we have certain outlets here, mm -hmm. but they can contact me because mm -hmm. right now we are interested in growing our network of distributors. We're okay. looking for a lot of distributors where we'll be able to have it across the country. Okay. So yes, we are open wow. up to getting more distributors. Okay. So I see it has its health benefits. Yes, it is. Okay. If people are in the diaspora and they want it, you can still export it? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Wow. So leave your, your details to them. What, where can they find you? Where they can they buy the products? Tell them right now. So What's you can, my social media handles are on Facebook and Instagram, okay. Label Farms. Okay. And you can just call 0548-622-738 and you get to reach me. Wow. Yes. And please. you can ship all over Ghana, everywhere. Yes, Africa, everywhere. everywhere. Yes, we are FDA wow. approved. So, Guys, I'm very inspired with her story. She's young African. And she's on the continent. She, she has her own farm here, which we will talk about later. And she's doing this product, everything natural, 100%. Extract the whole process. She's going to tell us about it. And, you know, it's not easy, trust me. You know, starting a business here in Africa. So, this movement is to support people like her. And, you know, to really make them understand that they've not wasted their time. And they are doing something really important. So, I'm asking you guys, please. Her number would be on the screen. Please call her, reach out to her. And, you know, buy some products from her. And trust me, it's very healthy. What are some of the health, health benefits? Tell them one. Help them so them. with the lemongrass, it detox. Mm -hmm. And with, with we ladies, when mm -hmm. we are having cramps, cramps, okay. it helps, it stimulates the uterus. That's menstrual pain. Right? Yes, menstrual wow, pain. I see. Wow, I see. You don't have to buy any foreign, uh, foreign grass. This is natural, right? Yeah, it lowers the uh, blood pressure. It's... Mm -hmm. um boost the immune system. immune system wow yes what time can we drink this in anytime, the morning? anytime. anytime? It's caffeine free so you can if i'm in the office i can still drink this even in the evening before bed before can, bed yes you can take it wow. guys caffeine free caffeine free yeah patronize here now let's talk about this is what what plant is this this is a lemongrass lemongrass oh okay okay yes. okay so wow i remember when i was a child my mom used to cut this and put it in hot water and we drink it is it the same thing? Yes, it is wow. the same thing. And you say it takes three months to grow? Yes, please. Wow. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. Wow. So after it's done like this, we carefully, mm -hmm. we, after we harvest them from this place, we carefully process it. Okay. That's when we get the, the tea bag. Okay. And Let's walk in, inside a little bit. Let's see. I saw a man here, right? Yes. You, you definitely live in Accra, right? So yes. who takes care of the, of the land? The man. The he, man that yes, he sees okay. to the day-to-day okay. -day activities here to make sure everything is going it's on good. well. Okay. Yeah. I'll speak to him okay, after, sure. after we speak. Okay. But wow, that is beautiful. Thank you. That's interesting. Did, were your parents into farming or... How, how did you My, get this motivation? Because, Charlie, <laughs> people just like to go and work, work in an office. They yeah, don't office. want to start their own business. But you are saying, no, I want to start my own business. I want to yeah. plant my own things, you know, make my own products. Mm -hmm. Where did, who inspired you? How did you get the inspiration? My mom. Your mom? My mom, okay. yeah. My mom likes farming. She, wow. like, she believes in farming and all that. So wow. she gave, she brought up this idea wow. that, okay, why don't we, because the land was bare. Yes. It's like, why don't we just do something, plant it, so okay. I would have daily like mm -hmm. constant supply mm -hmm. and at least we'll be able to give people give some out to people who use lemongrass okay. to do maybe their body creams mm -hmm. uh, soap um hair some, products and hair stuff. products we will talk about that i saw your sister yeah and your sister also used this extract to do hair creams as well yes please uh, hair products and mm -hmm. hair food yeah uh, it's in the family it's in the everybody's family. an entrepreneur yeah <laughs> Wow, guys, this is an amazing story. I will speak to her sister and also the man who take care of the land to really get an insight on how, you know, difficult it is to even plant this tree, the challenges and everything. So stay tuned. Mr. Felix. Sir. You know, your niece mm. told me about how you've been taking care of the land mm. when she's not here mm. and she's in Accra and mm. you've been the take caretaker of mm. the land. Oh, yeah. Okay, I mm. want to ask you, mm. this is the lemongrass tree. Mm. What, what goes into it? How long does it take to plant? What are the challenges? Mm. What are the difficulties mm. you face before it you know, bears fruit or it grows tall? Mm. So you, you, um, you know, uh, cut it off and use it. Yeah, before I start this one, mm -hmm. uh, it's very difficult. Okay. But, the grace of God, okay. 
Then I'll encourage myself so that we'll do. Okay. okay. Then we start it. Wow. Before all those things will come uh, in this way or you see okay. that way right now. Okay. By the grace of God. Wow. It's not my power. Wow. So when mm. we thank God. When mm. she came to you like, listen, mm. Uncle, please, I mm. want to do a farm mm. and then plant lemon grass mm. and then make my own products Product, from yes. it. Mm. Lemon uh, grass tea. tea. Yeah. What did you tell her? Am I going to, you're going to help her? What, what was the initial response when oh, she told you? I can advise the person okay. how, to plant it, how to plant it or you water it. Okay. Then I can lead the person okay. to learn it for the thing. Then we do it for his own okay. way. Okay. So, you know, most, most of the time when someone tells their parent that I want to be a farmer, we mm. often think mm. it's a very less job. Mm. Did you have that when they told you I just oh, want to plant? Me, this one is not in my mind. Okay. So I forget this one. Okay. Because the land we born me, mm -hmm. that is the farming land. Yes. So we should have to do the work in that land. Wow. Yes. Wow. Do you think it's possible for people to become wealthy just from farming? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yes, yes, yes. yes. It's, it's, wow. it's well. It's well. Um, wow. Wow. So people are watching from the diaspora, oh, yeah, they are watching oh, yeah, from oh, the yeah. US, yeah. UK, oh, yeah. they are interested in oh, coming yeah. to the motherland. Oh, yeah. Some want to do food, mm. you know, planting, farming. Mm. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm. What kind of produce or products do you think if they should come and uh, plant, they would still make some profit? Mm. The one thing is that mm -hmm. the one is a very impossible for everybody mm -hmm. to use. This seed, we must plant it, we must plant it. Mm -hmm. Without that, uh, you can never do that, that sort of business to okay. anybody. Okay. Mm. Okay. So what plants? Mm. What plants? That's why I say to you that if you want to plant, make it uh, the punch. Oh, the okay. Lettuce. Uh, okay. Uh, lettuce, yes. Okay. Wow. Mm. Guys, if you want to farm in Africa or Ghana and you want to plant something that would sell, he recommend you plant lettuce. Is that mm. correct? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Wow. Mm. Wow. Thank you so much oh, for no, looking no. out for her and taking care of the land. Oh, no, if you have no, a message for mm. the diasporans who are watching, mm. you know, what would that message be? Isabella oh. wants to, to take care of anyone who wants to. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, In the oh, Volta yeah. region? Oh, yes, yeah. oh, so yeah. if someone buy lands here mm. Mm. and they want to farm, mm. he would be able to do that? Do oh, yeah. Give them your information if they want to reach you. Oh, but this one, mm -hmm. I can say that God bless everybody. Mm -hmm. So if you want to invest there in a farm, mm -hmm. come and do it. Okay. They will get your money. Okay. No loss. You no get loss. your profit. Wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. yes. Wow. And you'll be here to make sure they yeah. get their profit. Oh, yes. Oh, wow. yes. Oh, yes. Thank you so much. No, sure. Wow. Now, um, before we go, mm. you said something about your sister's product. She extracts mm. the herbs and then make her products. So can I speak to your sister too? Sure. Okay, <laughs> let's go. So guys, if you are enjoying this episode, please, I want you to stay tuned. I'm going to speak with her sister, uh, who she extracts, you know, this same um, green um, lemon grass yes, and yes. use it for, you know, herbs, um, use it for hair products mm. and other things. Mm. So if you are interested in this episode, mm. stay tuned. And I love this story because they are Ghanaians. Mm. You know, they've traveled, you know, here abroad and everywhere, but mm. they don't like it. They want home, you know. Mm. They can always go back, come mm. back home and do something that mm. will make an impact on the continent. Mm. And if you are interested in things like this, please, I want you to stay tuned. Don't mm. go anywhere. Oh, you yeah. know, you can grab your popcorn and yeah, stay tuned. This actually smells really good. Mm -hmm. Well, I spoke to your cousin, right? And mm -hmm. she uses this as a tea bag. Mm -hmm. She um, takes it through the process mm -hmm. and then dry it or whatever, and then bags it, and mm -hmm. then it's very healthy. Yeah. And you are telling, she told me, you can still use the same thing as an oil uh, supplement for your hair mm -hmm. growth and everything. And that's what you are doing. As the repellent. Repellent. And then the Thai use it for their rice. Mm -hmm. And uh, when you grow this, in fact, this is a delicacy okay. in most homes in Anglonga here. Wow. Every home, out of 10, you get eight homes mm -hmm. grow lemongrass okay. because of its therapeutic properties. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So a typical morning tea mm -hmm. 
<laughs> instead of the tea bag, mm -hmm. lip tins and all that. Wow. This is what they use. Wash it's very it. Very healthy. Very healthy. It's very, very um when you have malaria, mm -hmm. dehydration, mm -hmm. this is the best. Wow. But the only thing is it has its sharp edges and well, I mean uh, a little bit of cut and you're getting <laughs> healthy. I think it, it's a very fair bargain. Yes. <laughs> so now I I am convinced how you can use it for tea. Yeah. But for oil um, supplement for hair growth, I can't round, I can't really understand it. We actually infuse it in our oils. Oh. So as we harvest, mm -hmm. um, we'll take it back to Accra, where okay. our production room, we'll clean it nicely, wash okay. it. And then we have mm -hmm. two processes. We can okay. actually choose to dry mm -hmm. and then use a fresh one as well. Oh, wow. Infuse it for a long while, mm -hmm. get the mm -hmm. smell, mm -hmm. infu that's the infusion. Infusion, wow. And then we formulate our oils with it. Wow. And this is one of them. Yes. This is cinna Cinnamon Plus. Yes. Um, this super, has min uh, super minty. Wow. And tell me about this product. Yes. This, the base is cinnamon, okay. but it still has the properties of the lemongrass, which serves mm -hmm. as an antioxidant. Wow. So, in a nutshell, we want to open the pores for mm -hmm. hair growth. Wow. So anything that would mm -hmm. open the pores for the follicles to be simulated, mm -hmm. this is what we have discovered, and it does the miracle for us. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Now, for for those watching who don't really know who you are, mm. your story, can you briefly introduce yourself, who you are, your name, and we we'll take it from there. Okay. Yes. Nunya is my name. Okay. And um, it's an LA name. Okay. I come from Anglonga. This is where the farm this is. This is your hometown. This is my hometown. Wow. So my dad gave it to me. Okay. And um, it came to a time where we had to rebrand. Okay. Because I have a saloon, mm -hmm. we needed to segment, separate mm -hmm. the saloon mm -hmm. and the product line. Oh, okay. So um, there was a need for a change okay. of name from Afro Kings. So it you started us. with a salon? Yes. So you had a salon? Yes, I is, have. You still have it? Yes. Which is called the Afro Kings. Kings. And then yes. since you started the um, extract and the products, you had to rebrand. And yes. now you put the name Nunia Naturals. Yes. Okay, to wow. Separated. To separate it. So in wow. actual fact, we are using my product, mm -hmm. the Nunia product, mm -hmm. in the salon strictly. Wow. Wow. Now you were telling me about how that started for you. Mm. Why you even found very important to even start producing your own um, um, you know what how do you call this what is the best word for it in it's an oil oil for, yeah. for hair yes so it's a restore oil we yeah. have the restore oil and the cinnamon plus okay so you, you told me a story yes. behind cameras yes. and you said you were I at started one point you with... had to cut your hair yeah and then you had to grow your own product because there was nothing out there mm. that could you know help your hair so you had to be the one to do that Tell me about that story briefly. So to start with, mm -hmm. um, I had exhausted all the products mm -hmm. that a hairdresser can think of. Wow. So after prolonged use, mm -hmm. I saw that in my case, I had complications. Okay. Okay. Which most women presently are also facing the same. The same. Wow. So which was? Um, alopecia. Okay whether you experience hair loss. Okay, Actually, wow. mine started here. Wow. And in that case, if you don't study alopecia and you don't detect it fast, it then it starts from here. So okay. most women in have frontals, frontals okay. and then here, it starts gradually. Wow. So that's what happened to me. Wow. I had to cut my hair, I had to stop every product grow back my hair and that wow. time that was the formulation i started using i mixed wow. some oils and it grew my hair people wow. saw the growth mm -hmm. and that was the transitioning period wow where i said that we had to stop all the chemicals yes. and then just use mm -hmm. the shop now it's going to go natural wow we are going to and use only natural all these foreign products, products was the ones that destroyed the hair in the first place because exactly. it was not made for the black no, hair. No, no. Right. No. We wow. have a lot of moisture mm -hmm. 
um, how do you call it? Shepherd mm -hmm. is for us. Yes. I don't know why God made it so because yes. we have a dry weather, mm -hmm. and He's given us a lot of oils. He's given wow. us a lot of shepherd. Wow. So I decided to use those mm -hmm. as the base, mm -hmm. and be patient, mm -hmm. consistent, mm -hmm. and be diligent about it. Wow. Even though the growth was slow. Mm -hmm. Um, the pace of growth that I wanted mm -hmm. because at the end of the day women we want it fast fast everything yes. fast 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 yes. fast but at the end of the day I got results people mm -hmm. saw where I started yes. Yes. and they, wanted they believed mm -hmm. in it and mm -hmm. now we have a range mm -hmm. counting 10 Wow yes 10 products 10 products wow. and this is one of them as well this, this is, is one of the oil. restore oil for the front house if someone has a hair loss to this yes. is what they can use yeah and also for the guys for the beard yes for those beard. guys those are watching who don't have beard <laughs> this is your solution okay <laughs> so actually they want it soft <laughs> yes they want to manage it wow so i always recommend the beard wow. oil and then they also want oh what can mm -hmm. we use to mm -hmm shampoo it to clean it okay so okay. yeah wow. they and also then what, have which one is this one they also have the shampoo okay, okay. which has shampoo. oil wow i like your packaging yeah it's, it's really nice mm. very beautiful thank you wow. a lot it's, has gone into this yeah i can imagine yeah after wow. the rebranding we had to wow you know get the a great packaging for it to that's amazing compete on the shelves wow now let me ask you when you told your family like listen I don't want you. Your, you told me your dad initially wanted you to be a doctor. <laughs> I let that. Oh my god. You let that. I'm sorry. Yeah. And you were like, no, I want to be a hairdresser. Ah. <laughs> In an African home. Mm. Okay. Yes. How was that? Oh my goodness. <laughs> yes. So mm -hmm. any normal parent mm -hmm. will love the child to have this professional yes. office. Yes. Kind of. Yes. It wasn't too pleasant mm -hmm. but um i realized that is the passion wow it's the okay. passion if a child wants to do something now mm -hmm. is the trend is changing mm -hmm. you either encourage the child mm -hmm. to go for it yes you know mm -hmm. if i had that chance mm -hmm. i believe and it's not too late i have okay. not regretted okay. insisting on what i really mm -hmm. love to okay. do now I can combine. Mm -hmm. I can wake up at dawn mm -hmm. and then go into the salon or play mm -hmm. on somebody's hair, yes. which I, I didn't regret. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure mm -hmm. he's smiling wherever he is. Yes, that's true. And I he's think like, he's proud of you. Yes. Wow. Being yeah. a woman and being an entrepreneur on, on the continent in Ghana, what are some of the challenges you face trying to bring up this amazing brand? Uh, basically, mm -hmm. the... Um, normally starting something mm -hmm. new mm -hmm. is like you only see what you want to see mm -hmm. at the end mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay it's, it's it's difficult for people to buy into yeah. what you see what you even want to do mm -hmm. i remember i started growing lemongrass mm -hmm. in my home in yes. accra mm -hmm. and my brother would be like mm -hmm. you have to buy flower pots mm -hmm and um, grow it in them yeah. today he's like oh there's a reason to everything yeah. that you do yeah. i said okay yes yeah, that is it a big farm here. exactly wow. so um that is it people don't see mm -hmm. but it's timing mm -hmm. but why do you think africans don't have that foresight you know it's people, changing it's changing now yes okay. it's changing the little you start with the little mm -hmm. have patience mm -hmm. and um of course when it gets to a certain times you need to scale up it is finances mm -hmm. so you ask yourself how are you going to you know combine mm -hmm. you know people who have not seen it there yet okay okay so how are you going to scale up mm -hmm. but start with a little okay Start wow. with the little that you have wow. and don't look at money now when you are beginning. But wow. at the end of the day, mm -hmm. yes, people will run wow. for it. Wow. Now, yes. this, what you are doing is making an impact and solving problems that have existed in, you know, Africa for long in our females. People are not confident in their hair because uh, hair loss, the hair get broken. It's tough. Yes, and they end up wearing wigs. They're not confident. But you are giving a solution to that. Yes. Wow, you're yes. really doing great. Yes, we have young ladies mm -hmm. 
who are rocking their Afro kinky no, hair now. I see you have locks. Too. Yes. And it's all natural. It's all natural. This is my hair. Wow. I've grown it for four years. Four years now. And um, it grows. Natural wow. hair grows. Wow. And I will not condone those who are using chemicals. Mm. All I'm saying is, or all I'm promoting is mm -hmm. still use natural ingredients. Mm -hmm. After relaxing or using the chemicals, mm -hmm. still use a natural shampoo okay. just to complement it mm -hmm. because I have to come to terms with it that mm -hmm. a lot of African ladies, most of them have very, very thick hair wow. and nothing can, yeah. it goes back, yeah. that's the, 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 the typical mm -hmm. 4A mm -hmm. or you know 3D mm -hmm. hair type is kinky, yeah, really so that's tough. What, why they say African hair is natural hair is hard to maintain. Exactly. So it needs a lot of moisture. Okay. A lot. Okay. So if that's so the it case, still goes products? back. Mm -hmm. We have the conditioner that okay. is the treatment conditioner. Okay. And then the hair food, then the oils. Okay. We actually would mix it and then wow. do treatment with it. Okay. Wow. You get it. Wow. So. After they are relaxing or whatever, they are facing out. A lot wow. of people are running away because it hurts. Wow. It's so harsh to the scalp. Wow. That is why the instruction is written on it that don't apply to the scalp. Wow. So for very, very, very tough hair, it will be relaxed. Yes. But it still goes back to the kinky. So we have to, wow. um, the mindset will change we'll gradually. Mm -hmm. They would embrace mm -hmm. our own natural products. products. Yeah. And um, it will be something that will help all African women to embrace the texture that they have. Wow. If it's tough, you can't do anything. Lock it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's to, it will still grow, <laughs> yes. which is a choice. Wow. Now, yeah. let's speak a little about this, right? The most Americans are moving back. Yeah. You know? Diasporans are moving back and they are mm. so excited about the continent. Mm. And they believe Africa is the future. But the African youth are hopping from embassies to embassies, <laughs> selling their lands that they have to seek for visa to go and work in McDonald's. <laughs> Why do you think we have this mindset? Oh, personally, mm -hmm. it's, um, it's a youthful exuberance. Yes. They want to explore. Mm -hmm. But now we want to, mm -hmm. personally, mm -hmm. I would impact the, on the youth mm -hmm. and push it to mm -hmm. them that you can make it mm -hmm. here wow. you just need to discover what that passion is wow. once you discover it you have a, a story mm -hmm. that you is and also about patience the yeah. youth most of them would they not have, have patience. the patience <laughs> to wait how long they look at me this quick exactly <laughs> that pay, we don't have it no wow. no 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 mm -hmm. no Till life hits you, mm -hmm. then you, oh, this is, mm -hmm. you know, how is, it was supposed to be. Wow. So it's about the patience. And so now we have to, to have just be patient. Wow. Just, wow. just, just, just be patient. And wow. you would know that, oh, okay, this is the way, mm -hmm. you know. Okay. Yeah. But what about the mindset, the Ghanaian mindset, though? The negativity. Uh, it's you, changing, though. It's changing. Are you oh, sure? Everybody. It's changing. Okay. So it's changing. it's changing. It will change. It will change. Yes. Okay. And once they see us, mm -hmm. I'm also young. I don't look yeah. 40, do no. I? Yeah. You are 40? Yeah. No I don't way. look it. <laughs> Why am I mentioning the age? It's lying. <laughs> <laughs> you, are, you are not So 40. when they see mm -hmm. young ladies mm -hmm. like us, they're like, oh, wow. she's young. Wow. Then the story is meaningful. Mm -hmm. They're like, oh, I can also Making become hair. like her. Yeah. She's not in gray hair. She's mm -hmm. not, her mm -hmm. back is not hurting mm -hmm. before she tells her story. Right. She right. can start somewhere and wow. tell her story. Yes. Wherever it lands you, if you get a financial breakthrough, whole la la, mm -hmm. you can, you know, start expanding yes. and whatever. Yes. But if you have a story, mm -hmm. you can impact and the youth. And they grab it. You have some intimacy. You connect yeah. with them, and they will take up. Wow. You'll be mentoring them. They'll wow. come for you. Wow. You know, you coach them, and it's it's, it's a blessing. Your story is to very be inspiring. impacting. Yes, I think your story is very inspiring. You've mm. been doing this for ten years now. Yeah. Wow. Mm. This ten years That's experience a lot of, of the, an entrepreneur city. <laughs> eh? in Ghana. Yes. In Africa. Yeah. Tell hmm. the people how it is like. <laughs> Not easy. Sleepless nights. Yes. 
<laughs> when you wake up at dawn, you, you have a lot of things in yeah. mind. Mm -hmm. And the, the next thing is, okay, mm -hmm. I've thought of all this. What is the resource? Mm -hmm. Then you prioritize. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can do this today. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one, if I don't have the transport or I don't have the means, mm -hmm. okay, let me see when yes. I can do that. Yes. Okay, let me speak to this person. Mm -hmm. What does this person think? Mm -hmm. And it's all about getting the trust mm -hmm. from your suppliers, yes. relationships. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. once you get people to help you out and then reason with you, mm -hmm. I believe things work yeah. out in its own I way. I believe too. I yeah. believe too. Your product is everywhere. Yeah. We went to Max Mat yeah. and your products are on the shelf. Oh, yeah. And this mall is one of the biggest in Ghana. Yes. Wow. And you, st when you started your product, do you, do you ever think you'd get to this level? Never. Never. I remember <laughs> we had not gotten anywhere. I went to Melcom. Okay. Today I'm on Melcom. <laughs> then one guy said, I, but this product is, mm -hmm. is not popular. Mm -hmm. I, will, I had to go back wow. and think about it. It's not wow. popular. Okay. He should wait. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure Malcolm, <laughs> can we have your product to shelf it? Fight you for it now. Yes, they it's will come. Everywhere. They will come. Wow. That is beautiful. People are watching now, and a lot of um, Africans are complaining about their hair loss and everything. You know, people in the diaspora they want to patronize your your product. Do you export it? And yes. if so, what are their process and what do we, they have to do? We are export ready. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. The whole of. Um, well, we can, okay. yes, it's possible. Okay. Everything, is possible. Everything is possible, and it starts from especially when one person uses it, mm -hmm. testifies, mm -hmm. and that is the breakthrough. You wow. don't need to talk much, wow, it sells on wow. its own. So, if they use it, they don't like they come for their money, of course. <laughs> you that don't talk you much, <laughs> yes, you don't wow. talk much. But do you really think it's possible to make it here in the continent? Yes, yeah, start here, really. Yes, if people start are here. watching from the diaspora right now, they are Africans in the diaspora, they want to come back home. They want to be like you, an entrepreneur. Come on ground, grow their own plants, you know, do something for themselves. I say start here. Start really? here because at the end of the day, mm -hmm. you would come back. Where mm -hmm. do you come from? It's mm -hmm. Ghana, it's Africa. Mm -hmm. So your people will need to, mm -hmm. you need to impact where you come from okay. before you go there. Wow. When they see it working in your hometown, mm -hmm. That alone is promising. Wow. Then you can, you know, wow. Wow. raise your shoulders and say that in my oh. home, mm -hmm. what my about people those who are, are saying that Ghana is hard. Yeah, is Ghana it's hard? a term. <laughs> well, I don't want to add that to my phrase yes. because it's all about your faith. Yes. Yeah. Sometimes you will not have it. Mm -hmm. The economy, yes, mm -hmm. the dollar is rising mm -hmm. and all that, mm -hmm. but. If you fold your arms, you mm -hmm. grow hungry. Mm -hmm. Because wow. if you use that term, it's the mindset. It's just an excuse for people not to. Exactly. Okay. Wow. Start with the little. That yeah. Is. Yes. So wow. um, that term, yes. So it means mm -hmm. that start with what you have. Mm -hmm. Don't overspend. Okay. Just do within your means. Okay. Wow. You'll be good to go. Wow. How long do they give themselves until they say, okay, this business was not successful, so I'm giving up? How long do you think each and every entrepreneur should give themselves before they give up? There's no time frame. Mm. You keep pushing till you get what you want. Wow. The desired um, appearance, mm -hmm. the branding. Mm -hmm. When you see it, you smile because mm -hmm. you have gone through the mail, mm -hmm. you have metamorphosized, mm -hmm. You've gone through the test, you have mm -hmm. prototyped, mm -hmm. you have worked on clients, mm -hmm. they have believed in you. Mm -hmm. Nobody comes in to bring a bad report. Mm -hmm. If it's a product, it's food, nobody has come to say that, oh, I took this food mm -hmm. and then I had upsets. Once you get that, it is, you are full. Wow. You have that um, energy mm -hmm. to go on and on and on and to do more. So you see people enjoying your product mm -hmm. is wholesome. Wow. It's just yeah. awesome. And you said you, you learned the formulas and everything, how to make it by yourself. Um, yes, the extra ones mm -hmm. you need to learn. Just like I told you that mm -hmm. you can learn, go to the catering school, mm -hmm. but it's the additional, you yeah. know, spice that yeah, make actually. it different. Okay. There are so many black shampoos, mm -hmm. but what makes mine different? Mm -hmm. 
Do you get it? Yes. So that will be my secret ingredient. And wow. I'll say that this is different wow. from the ones mm -hmm. on the market. Mm -hmm. So you will also have to work diligent, mm -hmm. test, wow. do all the tests. Mm -hmm. And one day you see that, oh, this jollof that mm -hmm. I did is quite different. Wow. This formulation that I did is different. different. So you stick to it. Mm -hmm. When you sleep over, the formulas just come. Mm -hmm. Why won't you use this? Mm -hmm. This cinnamon, I was just there. I love carrot cakes. Mm -hmm. I love the smell of wow. cinnamon. Let me research into it. Mm. And hola la, it was, it's working. Wow. So it's about you getting that wow. um, inspiration, you mm -hmm. getting that divine mm -hmm. recipe or mm -hmm. formulation. Mm -hmm. And wow. once you obey, like that yeah and this is your best selling the new release and is the best yeah selling. the new is, is, is best selling they love the smell and you can see the magical mm -hmm. you know you can see that is when they see oh this is rosemary this mm -hmm. is what we use in mm -hmm. the kitchen yeah oh, and it's edible it's edible as well mm -hmm. so that's the wow. beauty of it wow yeah i love i love her story so much if you are enjoying this i want you to look at you know the name on the screen her social media and her socials everything will be on the screen and also in the description go check her out you can buy her product it can be shipped international okay you are in south africa you are in kenya you are in namibia anywhere in africa it can be shipped to you three to five days maximum you would have the product international you are from the us uk you can also buy and sell if you want to because trust me you know based on the testimonies that you would, you'd record later you'd see that this is guaranteed, okay? We are not here to, you know, you know, lie to you. This is guaranteed. And she's an entrepreneur and laid her life down to, you know, change something, you know, because she went through it and she didn't like it, you know. So please, please patronize, okay? Mm. Patronize. You know, people say we don't like supporting our own. I think that is changing as well. What would you say? Yes, it's changing. Mm -hmm. it's, it's changing. Okay. If you identify a gift in somebody mm -hmm. and um, you, you should be moved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, um, you should be moved, you should be touched wow. that wow. this will go somewhere mm -hmm. and it's to your own account, it's mm -hmm. to your own, it's a blessing okay. to see that, oh, you were part of this story. Okay. Wow. It's just a blessing. Wow. So if you want to help somebody, forget about the mm -hmm. inputs. Mm -hmm. If you can and you have the means, just wow. help the person if wow. you can I like that. and the journey that person will never forget yes. you because wow. you are part of the wow. person's story. I have so many people I owe mm -hmm. gratitude to mm. and um, I can't look back and say that they haven't been impactful. Wow. I'll mention them wherever wow. I go. Nice. Yeah. Wow. Um, you know, people are watching right now, okay? Some of them want to come to Ghana and do business. What do you think, what kind of business do you think they can come and do? Three business advice for them. <laughs> <laughs> that one, it depends on the mm -hmm. passion. If you want to be a partner with somebody, okay. you should have the same dream, mm -hmm. um, passion. Mm -hmm. So you can contribute to the person's okay. input. Okay. Because the person is going to see you as a mentor okay. or an investor okay. or... Um, a support in a way mm -hmm. so it's all about collaboration okay. establishing good relationship okay. and um, deliberating I don't think anybody will come and say that, take over mm -hmm. um, a young business okay. you get it mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's about relationship I and see. dreaming with the person okay. yeah I see. so I, I, I know you travel there you travel you mm -hmm. see a lot mm -hmm. at the end of the day you also want your products to be on the shelves mm -hmm. to compete mm -hmm. with other products mm -hmm. okay. so it has been an eye-opener okay. it, it has taught me that mm -hmm. I can do better wow. even if the product is little mm -hmm. that little container mm -hmm. or that little bottle mm -hmm. you can invest in right. you can start with 50 bottles wow. sell it mm -hmm. off get the profit out of it mm -hmm. and then you keep increasing mm -hmm. so packaging yes I've seen a lot a lot yeah. and you you be like oh you want your baby to wear this mm -hmm. you know to be on the shelves exactly. so 
it's the final outlook you know and yes. how people embrace mm -hmm. the african product they mm -hmm. love it mm -hmm. once it's african and once it's your own brand mm -hmm. just like any other brand mm -hmm. they are like oh yeah. gosh yeah you get it so wow. that is where i get the excitement yeah. like oh not only at africa yeah. but over there oh they love it wow. so i'm like wow. I, I don't want to say i want to give up but <laughs> you want to go there start yes. with their mm -hmm. them and then yes. they know wow. they know wow. they know we have good stuff wow. people people normally get chance to travel and when they go they don't want to come back you know but you came back yes and then like i'm saying i want to create that impact mm -hmm. it should be a yeah, household yeah. name okay it should wow. be a household name wow. Wow. that is my focus i like that let's walk around i have more questions for her yeah. If you are enjoying this episode, please, I want you to like the video, you know, share to your friends and family so that they can also enjoy too. <laughs> so before we go, you know, someone is watching, it's like, wow, this woman is amazing. She looks <laughs> very beautiful. <laughs> Who is the lucky man? <laughs> <laughs> Who I have three it? boys. <laughs> I have three boys. Three, my first born, yes. How old is he? 10, 10 Jojo years? is 10, wow. Fafa is 9, wow. and then the little one is 7. 7. But you look so young. Is it because of this natural police? Oh, well, it's what you take in, I believe, so wow. lifestyle. Wow. Yes. Give advice lifestyle. to the young ones because it's lifestyle. This, this Don't thing. eat after 6. Eh? Exercise. Banku is calling. Yes, Banku I is do. Banku on boat meetings. Then you say, Oh, you after meet? six, don't try. Wow. Try it's our life. And I love lemon grass. I love so teas. Ah, you know. Wow. Yes, I wow. eat what I love. Wow. Yes. So that's all you, about if it. If you have a last message for the people watching right now, mm -hmm. okay, what would that message be? Stay focused. Mm -hmm. The young ones, I am on them. They are my topic. Mm -hmm. Okay. I love to impact. Stay focused. We don't want to grow old before we tell our stories. Yes. No, yes. no, 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 no. We don't want to be 50. Mm -hmm. Esther Oklu, mm -hmm. she's done in Kulenu for a long while. Mm -hmm. She's now telling her story. No, no. no. Between Whilst 30 are, and 40, mm -hmm. you have to get a story. Once you discover mm -hmm. what you, your passion mm -hmm. is, be diligent, wow. be focused. So this is the message to even entrepreneurs too? Entrepreneurs, okay, to yes. To tell their story, exactly. their difficulties. How there to... are competitions, okay. but stick to yours. Okay. Believe in oh, yours. Wow. Because that's what the competitions, it's, it's, bound, it's oh. there. Wherever you are, mm -hmm. the market is wide. Mm -hmm. You can't supply the, all the, the two yes. billion, yes. People. you know. Yes. So stick to your corner wow. and then get mm -hmm. focused. Mm -hmm. Once wow. you get focused, they will come to you. Wow. If you if you get the chance to change anything about Ghana or on the continent of Africa, what would that be? Believe in ourselves. Ourselves. It's wow. Africans' time. Wow. We have so many things here in Africa wow. that um, it's amazing. It amazes me, and I think Africa is, is the heartbeat mm -hmm. of of God. Wow. He has given us so many things. It's mm -hmm. just for us to tap into it yes. and believe in it. Wow. It could be wow. a small tomato farm. It can be anything. And we don't like going, here am I. I haven't been here for so many yeah. years, but there are so many things. The oceans, wow. the sea, the land. We don't want to go back to our villages. No. We want to stay in the city wow. and be um, um, yeah. We don't want to town. go back to our roots. No. It's like we are ashamed of it. Most, no. I, don't, I, don't mind, I mean, most Africans, I didn't know this. Most Africans are ashamed of their grandfathers and their... Oh, no. You know. But I have a visitor at home. She's mm -hmm. from the U.S. Okay. The first thing she... Jennifer is in Keta now. Wow. She spent one week there. Wow. And she went to Kumasi. Went to use the lawn, Kente, mm -hmm. learn to. Mm -hmm. She said she wants her name. Wow. She's Akosia Frema. Wow. And look at it, those who are abroad. Yes. They, they, but we Please. here on the continent don't feel like that. Yeah, so. Wow. We wow. don't know what we have. We don't Charlie, know. know thyself. Thank you. Know thyself. Do you think this has been worth it, going on this journey and opening up your business? Has it been worth it for you? It has. Wow. No regrets. No regrets. No. 
not 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 no no if not my i look at mm -hmm. my children and I, they tell me mm -hmm. um mommy we don't want to collapse this business mm -hmm. and it's oh wow that is fulfilling enough yes you get it yes. so it's about they also continuing like any other brand wow. won't wow. i smile one day and yeah. see the boys mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. taking and then they come to my production room. Wow. Mommy, can we help you to label? Yes. Can wow. we help really? you to stick? Yes. And I tell them, clean this bottle, wear your gloves. Mm -hmm. And they love it. Wow. And they ask me, won't you do anything for the children? I'm like, <laughs> take your time. It is coming. It will come. It is in the works. What will be your last words before we go? I've said it already. Already. She already <laughs> said everything. Okay. So I want more for you guys. You know, I want to make sure I pick her brain. Okay? You've exhausted everything. So thank you so much. For, yeah. for coming on the show yeah I, I would definitely take this home yes and try and it try it okay so these are mine guys mm -hmm. if, if you want it you can maybe text me and then i'll think about <laughs> this maybe you can share it and if you want to buy it please and please again the informations are in the description yes. okay and please this let's support yeah. let's support the african owned businesses okay yes. When you invest in black-owned businesses, the world comes to the black-owned businesses. And we understand ourselves more than anybody else does. You know, most foreign products just destroy your hair. But this one, she went through herself and then saw that there's something missing. There's a disconnect. And then she took her time to investigate and find out this is the best product she can use for herself. And she's recommending, to, you know, for you. So please patronize it. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. This has been an amazing episode. If you are interested in videos like this, please always stay tuned, like, and yeah, you won't be disappointed.